The man in charge of a Vatican-authorized investigation of the Buffalo Diocese was back today. Brooklyn Bishop Nicholas DiMarzio was spotted quietly taking meetings here in western New York today. Good evening once again. I'm Scott Levin. And I'm Mary Alice Demler. Thanks to a hidden camera, Two On Your Side has video of the Brooklyn Bishop meeting and greeting a series of people in Amherst. On this exclusive story tonight is our investigative reporter, Steve Brown. Steve? Scott and Mary Ellis, the Catholic term for this investigation is an apostolic visit, which sounds innocent, but it's a serious review in this case of the diocese, Bishop Malone and his handling of the clergy sex abuse scandal. And we know Bishop DiMarzio is still at work putting together his investigation because we saw him out in Amherst today. It was at the Millersport or at the Marriott Hotel on Millersport on hidden camera. We have DiMarzio emerging multiple times from a private room at the hotel restaurant near the lobby. The bishop would escort visitors to a room where he and another priest would meet with these people. None of the interviewed subjects appeared to be clergy. The meetings lasted from 15 to 30 minutes. This is the first visual proof that DiMarzio is still at work on his investigation following his announced visit to Buffalo three weeks ago. When it is completed, his report goes to the Vatican for review. Normally, these investigations are done with exceptional secrecy, but we got a tip, staked out the hotel, and captured DiMarzio essentially at work on the report. We asked for comment. The Brooklyn Diocese acknowledged DiMarzio's visit today as part of the investigation, but would not comment further. Buffalo Bishop Richard Malone did know, we we're told, about DiMarzio's visit and released this statement. Bishop DiMarzio continues to meet with representatives of both clergy and the lay people within his diocese as part of his fact finding mission. Now, again today, Bishop Malone describing the investigation in a welcoming tone, but these probes are very serious. There was a similar investigation of the Memphis, Tennessee Catholic Diocese just last year. Four months later, that bishop was removed by post, removed from his post by Pope Francis. Steve Brown, Channel 2 News.